So I wanted to show you guys something upsetting that has happened here on the homestead. Um, in the winter time in the snow is when the voles with the letter V a vole, uh, they come out and make all their tunnels and they kind of wreak havoc on your garden and you can't do anything about it because they do it all under the, under the snow. And, um, they got to a couple of my apple trees, I'm pretty sure. Um, so I went through and I was checking on my trees and I noticed that two of them have a lot of like vole lines, uh, trails all around them. And when I went and kind of shook the trunks, they were pretty loose in the soil and like they should have been rooted in by now. And I went to a third apple and that one is rooted in and there's not very many actually there's like no vole tracks around the base of it. And so I did a little bit of research and I found that they really don't like sharp rocks. Um, it doesn't feel good on them. So I am currently digging trenches around all three of them, even though um, they only got two of the trees. I still have a third one that I want to protect. So I'm digging trenches around them about uh, probably about six inches deep and I'm going to fill it with gravel and hopefully that will be enough of a barrier to help protect my trees so that they don't get any more vole damage. So if you look around the base of this tree, there really is no sign of any vole activity. And when I go to shake the trunk, it's pretty rooted in there, pretty good down. There's not much movement happening. And then over here, I already dug it up. So I'm digging a trench all the way around and I'm gonna put some gravel in there uh, to hopefully kind of protect the root ball. The roots can still grow through it and around that, around the gravel and everything, but it should hopefully be a vol deterrent. But when I go and shake this one, you can see how much the soil is kind of moving around under there. So that's not good. And then here you can see like all of these vole trails right here. There's a vole trail all the way up to here and all the way into there. And when I go to shake this one, that thing is really moving and don't have much hope for it, but we'll see. It's still budding out. So there is hope for there to be life in it this year. So I'm going to dig a trench around this one and the first one that I showed you and fill it with gravel as well. Started on this one, which is our honey crisp, and uh, we'll go from there. So that's what I'm working on today. So there we go. One down, one, two to go. Hopefully this works. I got the second trench dug out and another wagon load of gravel to go around there so on to the next all right two down two down one to go and while i was here i just planted a comfrey for some little fruit tree guild and working on that so just have one left to go over there and then hopefully these three will be protected from those dang voles final tree is rocked in so one two three then when i plant my other trees i'll probably have to do something similar good thing i've got enough gravel <laughs> 